Hey guys, Mastic is back with some Borderlands for you today, of course, and this is going to be another bit of an Easter egg across both Borderlands games. Uh, I've never covered these on my channel before because I really didn't have both games installed uh, on the PC, but now that I do, I can do it. Uh, a lot of people have probably already seen it, but there's probably some people that have never seen these or never heard of these unless you knew what to look for, but we'll get straight into it. Here we are at Treacher's Landing uh, in Borderlands, and... You gotta jump onto this boat here. I'll show you where it is on the map. Uh, you jump onto this boat, and what happens is you'll actually get an achievement when you first jump onto this boat here. I think it's just called I'm on a boat. And there's actually a little bit of an Easter egg uh, that is hidden here, so it's really cool. There's also a, a chest you can crack there. It's like a Marcus bobblehead there as well. All right, so the Easter egg uh, basically involves shooting barrels in a particular order. So let me see, I've got it written down here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you got to shoot the one behind the boat, which is this one. Alright, that one. And now you have to shoot the green one that is up here. Shoot that one. And now you have to shoot the blue one on the boat. You're probably best to get off the boat for that because it can trigger a couple other ones. Shoot this one. And the last one uh, is this red one over here. So if we shoot this, now something really weird should happen. If we did it right, here we go. <laughs> we can get out onto the water for a bit of a better look. You can't go too far or the lasers will target you. So they pop up and then you see Tannis riding a fish, which is incredibly random. Uh, really, really random. Uh, there is There should be music playing. I'll turn it back on. Hopefully the video doesn't get claimed by some automated YouTube thing, but uh, really, really random Easter egg. It's just out in the middle of nowhere. Those things pop up, the music plays, and then uh, Tannis just fades, <laughs> fades off into the distance. So extremely cool. And the coolest thing is, it actually made it across to Borderlands 2. That's right, the same Easter egg made it into Borderlands 2. Uh, I'm sure a lot of people have probably seen the first one, but uh, there might be a few people that haven't seen it make it across into the second one. So here we are in Sawtooth Cauldron, I believe, wherever the map is, somewhere there, Sawtooth Cauldron. It's way down here, and it's actually sort of technically out of bounds. Uh, what I'll do is I'll try and disable the HUD uh, once I've shot all the barrels to give you a good look at the Easter egg. So the order for this particular one is you've got to shoot the blue one here. Then you have to shoot the red one near the hut. Then you need to shoot the green one out on the water. Then you need to shoot the yellow one near this barricade. And the last one should be this purple one here. So we'll shoot this. Now what we'll do is we'll get to here, tab, uh, disequip this weapon, disequip, it's not a word, but I just made it up, and then tab, there we go, so that should give us a nice clean view, I think we can get to about here, so here we go, so this is the Easter egg in Borderlands 2, so this one is, this one's a little bit more elaborate, and uh, she, she does a bit of a stunt, but here comes Tannis, off in the distance, riding a fish, somewhere, where are you? So there you go. <laughs> Trying to catch me riding down here. She comes busting through. And you can see there there's the fire and the spinning blades of death. She's going to try and do a magnificent jump. <laughs> there we go. So <laughs> it's just, it's such a random thing. Uh, I think it's actually the level designer uh, that hides them in there. I, I'm not sure whether it's Hats. Uh, I think Hats was the guy that actually... Uh, did the teddy bear Easter egg, so I'm not sure whether he's responsible for these as well, but very cool, very well hidden if you don't know the order of barrels and where you have to be to shoot them. Uh, very, very cool indeed. Uh, but that's it for the Easter eggs I think I'll cover in Borderlands. Uh, the next thing I'll do will be the uh, texture mod guide. A lot of people wanted to see that, so that'll probably be broken up into a few different episodes because it is quite technical. I'll start with just the basics and then uh, if there's enough interest, I might go a bit deeper and explain some of the more uh, difficult aspects when it comes to actually modifying a lot of the textures. So we'll see how we go. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And until the next video, we'll see you later.